a dog's chance even not given for Meg. Kate didn't contact and reach out to Meg how difficult it is. Kate, the Duchess of Cambridge refrained from contacting Meghan Markle after the birth of Lilibet Diana due to children's schedule but a congratulatory present was sent over, a royal expert claimed. Earlier in the year, Kate, the Duchess of Cambridge was reported to have reached out to Meghan Markle after Lilibet Diana's birth with notes and gifts but they were allegedly rejected. However, royal expert Neil Sean denied the speculation and said that Kate never reached out to the Duchess of Sussex as she understood that having three kids is fraught and expected things would be equally difficult for Meghan with two children. Instead, a present with a card congratulating Meghan and Harry for the birth of their daughter was sent over as a symbol of politeness and courteousness. Mr. Sean told his YouTube channel, the story goes that Catherine tried to reach out five times to Meghan to offer congratulations on a personal level following the birth of Lily Diana. Now as we often say here on the show in fair and balanced terms, let me tell you the truth, that simply didn't happen and it wasn't through any spite or anything like that. What I've been told is Catherine really understood, having three children herself, what a fraught time it can be. After all the Sussexes at this point are now parents to two little people, so she wouldn't really think to butt in and try and offer assistance and help. She would wait to be asked to be invited. He added, what we do know is there was a present sent over and a card congratulating the couple. That is where the story ends they were being civil polite and courteous obviously their family remaining still. Kate and Meghan reportedly have never been close due to the difficult relationship between their respective husbands but they shared a respectful and warm relationship with each other, according to an insider. They explained, they were never that close, but the reason they're not speaking is because of the rift between Prince Harry and Prince William. Harry and William have communicated sparingly over the last year, but none of their communications have been friendly in quite some time. There is real animosity that the brothers have toward one another, and that has spilled over to Meghan and Kate's relationship, making it very hard for them to be friends or even friendly. Expert Katie Nicol OK. Magazine that the Duke and Duchess of Cambridge are expected to send Christmas gifts to Archie and Lilibet to keep their Christmas royal traditions going. She said, they give gifts to the whole family and that includes all their nieces and nephews. Earlier when Prince Harry and Meghan were active royal members, the family have been known to present each other gag gifts or more useful presents rather than big offering. Prince Harry confirmed to James Corden's The Late Late Show that his grandmother gifted a waffle maker to Archie. He said, Interestingly, my grandmother asked us what Archie wanted for Christmas and Meg said a waffle maker. Meg makes up a beautiful organic mix, in the waffle maker, flip it, out it comes, he loves it. Archie literally wakes up in the morning and says waffle. Meanwhile, Meghan Markle has been named the most intelligent member of the British royal family by Oxford Royal. The Duchess of Sussex academic credentials placed her at the top of the royal family, in a study that scrutinized all their school marks and academic careers. Markle came out at the top, with her degree from Elite Northwestern University, in Evanston, Illinois. She holds a double degree in theater and international relationships, from the university, which placed number 30 on the Q's World University rankings this year. Life as a royal isn't always an easy job and involves a lot of dealing with extensive scrutiny and life in the public spotlight, and Meghan Markle's academic strengths have equipped her perfectly for this role, a spokesman for Oxford Royal said, quoted by the New York Post. While the Duke and Duchess of Sussex may have resigned from their roles as working royals, they have captured the interest and attention of the world, and Meghan's desire to use her platform to raise awareness over serious world issues reflects her intelligence, analytical mind and educational pedigree.